rest of my life. I'll be with you. I'll stay by your side, honest and true. How did the people that you left behind yeah. react? They uh, they reacted well, I think, you know, but, you know, I think I showed a, a side that I'm really confident about my choice. Good. You know, but, Good. but it took me time. It took me really like at least these 10 months and mm. this year to really decide, okay, I understand now. Mm. This is not good for me. I have to, I have to stop it. Inshallah, we, we pray for their guidance yeah. as well. I mean, Inshallah, I mean, Inshallah. So yeah. you've made this transition. You've you've now won many accolades, alhamdulillah, for uh, for your music. Uh, yeah. I know that you you write a lot of music. You co-write your music yes. as well. You're responsible for the for the melodies and mm. rhythms, etc. What are the influences for you in your music? Everything. I mean, like I'm gonna I'm gonna name some. Go on, then. My faith, of course. Yeah. Islam is like one big inspiration and influence. You know, life itself. Just traveling. You know you. I was sitting in the plane and just came up with the song. I was looking down. And really, I would like to tell people, you know, when you're in the plane, look down, man. Mm. Look down and don't say just, wow, mashallah, what beautiful. Look down like you can't see human beings. Mm. Just realize how small you are. You know, and I was really looking down. I was like, you know, I, I started like, I care about you. You know, I started, I came mm. up with this one big family. Like, really, what are you fighting over? You know, do you, what crazy, how crazy mm. can you be? Think about it. Look at yourself in the mirror. You look exactly like everyone else, you know? And I was thinking this, this song came from I was in the plane. So yeah, so everything around me gives me inspiration to write something. So you're, you've made a lot of videos now, mashallah, and they're, they're, there's a lot of attention to detail. The production values yeah. are very high, artistically uh, striking. Mm. How do, do you have can input in the videos themselves, in what goes on? Mm. Uh, you know, how, how does that process work? The, the, the videos is themselves, usually we just contact, like we use, okay, we want to work with this director. Mm. Or like sometimes we try two or three directors and they send us the storyboard and we say, okay, this one is good. So we choose this one. So basically we just give the, the song itself speak, you know, have, have the message. Mm. So we just give it to the director, he comes up with a story and we like it and we do it. So that's like the video is the director's idea. With the music that you've, uh, the albums that mm. you've got, there's two albums. Yes. Uh, and all the songs that you put together, what would you say is your personal favorite or the one that perhaps touches you the most? I think in my opinion, uh, like for me, it's Thank You Allah. You know, this song is really, why, why it's special to me because after I started practicing, mm. I started seeing things from a different perspective. Mm. Really, I started noticing everything differently. Mm. Like the clouds, the mountains, the trees, like, you know, just by driving, I see, I'm looking at the sky, wow, you know, everything's so amazing now, you know, mm. all of a sudden. And, uh, and I started like looking back, I moved to this city, I met these new friends, I did this, I did this, this happened to me, this, it can't be a coincidence, you know, everything was meant to be, everything led me mm. where I am today, you know. And this is why I'm saying this song, basically, like, I know that you've been guiding me all the time, but you waited to show me that when I took this step. Being in the environment that you're in and, you know, being at these concerts and uh, etc., sometimes it may feel that you're kind of on the border because of sometimes Absolutely. where that people are reacting. Absolutely. So how do you deal with that and how do you account to yourself? So this is a very good question and, you know, like it's really challenging. What we're doing is so hard sometimes. It really, you know, we question, I question myself. It feels like, you know, am I really doing this for the right reason, you know, mm. or for the fame or whatever, you know, everything, anything. But really, I remember something always is that why do I sing and not him or her? You know, I remember that this talent is not something that I created. I go back to that, you know, I try always to think about that. This is something that is giving. A talent is a gift and a gift, you know, something that you are responsible for, for now. And this is what I think about. And I'm very happy, alhamdulillah, that 
I at at the end, you know, I I used to work in the wrong mm. path, you know. I used to use my talent in the wrong way, and uh, Alhamdulillah, I'm happy that you know, uh, you know, I'm using it now mm. for pos in a positive way. Slide through your guidance Peace be upon you, my beloved Ya Habibi, Ya Muhammad Ya Nabi, Salam Alayka Ya Rasul, Salam Alayka Ya Habib, Salam Alayka Salawatullah Alayka If you could meet yourself as a young boy, mm. what would I the, tell the little Mahazel? What would you tell him? <laughs> Be good to your mother. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make her sad. <laughs> yeah, I think that's that's a good thing to do. I'm sure there are many people who are watching, the the, the viewers who are watching right now, who are really getting to know you as a person. Yeah. I'm sure there are those who aspire to want to do something that you're doing or make a difference in some way. What would your advice be to those people? Ask yourself why I'm going to do this, you know? And the second thing is surround yourself with very good people. Mahazain, Jazakallah Khair. It's been a so pleasure much. having you as a Thank guest you. Yeah. on Saturday Night Live. Thank you. Thank you.